Hello, and welcome to This Month in Datadog, where we'll update you on our latest features, product announcements, events, and more. This episode, we're spotlighting a trio of new releases that enhance your serverless experience. We're also covering how Cloud Sim Investigator helps you identify attacker activity, tracking the CIS compliance posture of Linux resources with cloud security management, quickly troubleshooting synthetic tests with side-by-side -side comparisons, and several new integrations for AI and LLM tech stacks. Before we get to those, we've got an exciting update to share with you. We recently published our 2023 State of Serverless report, which captures the most important trends across the serverless landscape. Building upon last year's report, we analyzed usage data for more than 20,000 Datadog customers to better understand how serverless is being used in the real world. For example, we've seen AWS Lambda use on ARM double over the past year, bringing the share of organizations using ARM to invoke Lambda functions to 11%. Dig into this key insight and more by checking out the link in our show notes. And now, on with the show. We've got a pair of exciting new security features to share with you. Kicking things off is Cloud Sim Investigator, which now correlates security signal context with logs to help you better identify attacker activity. By bringing together security and observability into one unified view, Cloud Sim Investigator enables teams to more easily identify and investigate suspicious behavior within their cloud environments. Our second new security feature lets you track the CIS compliance posture of your Ubuntu, Red Hat, and Amazon Linux resources with cloud security management. Previously, cloud security management supported cloud resource and container-based misconfiguration detections. Now, CSM coverage extends to hosts, helping teams reduce misconfiguration risk and work towards CIS compliance for their Linux resources. More quickly, troubleshoot your synthetic tests with side-by-side -side screenshot comparisons. With this new feature, you're better able to compare failing and successful tests so you can see at a glance what changed and caused tests to fail. As the number of AI-powered apps grows, more machine learning models are deployed into production and require monitoring to ensure their health and performance. We're excited to announce new integrations for AI and LLM tech stacks, each with their own out-of-the-box dashboards and monitors. Datadog's Vertex AI integration provides inference time metrics in production environments to monitor the performance of your custom models deployed on the Google Cloud Vertex AI. This new integration comes with an out-of-the-box dashboard with prediction counts, latency, errors, and resource utilization for each deployed model, as well as recommended monitors to alert on spikes in memory usage, CPU utilization, and more. But that's not all. You can now monitor the health and performance of widely used NVIDIA GPUs, rapidly troubleshoot latencies in WeVA database instances, analyze Airbyte data integration jobs by completion status, sources of failure, and more, and track which PyTorch models are deployed as well as identify resource contentions. That was just a sneak peek of the many features we released this month. For a full list, visit the link shown. This month, we're putting the spotlight on three releases that make it even easier to monitor your serverless applications. Here's Sumeta to tell you more. Thanks, Jeremy. I'm Sumeta Mehta, and I'm a product manager at Datadog focused on serverless monitoring. Serverless infrastructure tools are able to abstract away many of the infrastructure and operational challenges of modern software development. However, given the managed nature of these services, Visibility into utilization, errors, and areas of optimization can be limited yet critical to maintain robust observability of these workloads and applications. Our recently released State of Serverless report found that serverless adoption is continuing to grow across all major cloud providers. Today, we're excited to share that we've added support for three more popular serverless platforms, AWS Step Functions, Google Cloud Run, and Azure Container Apps. Let's take a closer look. 
Datadog's serverless product provides a dedicated monitoring and debugging experience for serverless workloads within each cloud. Toggling to the AWS view, you can get an organized entry point to quickly understand the health and status of your Lambda functions and associated services such as SNS, EventBridge, and API Gateway. You're also able to drill into functions and services to see their metrics, logs, and traces in context. We're excited to announce a public beta for dedicated step function support, enabling you to understand the bottlenecks and errors in your step functions end to end. With this new feature, you can alert on and quickly identify issues like high latency steps or errors in executions for any step function. You can easily pull up associated metrics, logs, and traces, all located in one unified view. In step function traces, each span gives you the information on a step's duration, input, and output, as well as associated logs and aggregated errors, giving you detailed information to easily debug and optimize your step functions. If you're interested in participating in the beta, reach out to us with the link in the episode description. In our Google Cloud Serverless view, we provide an overview of your cloud functions and cloud run services, so you can quickly identify issues across your GCP serverless workloads. And take your investigations further by drilling into unified logs, metrics, and traces. And finally, within our Azure tab is a workload map that at a glance can help you better understand the health of your Azure container apps, Azure app service plans, Azure Function Apps, and Azure Web Apps. From there, you can now drill into metrics, logs, and traces for your Azure Container Apps to understand and debug your serverless applications in depth. We are excited to continue expanding our first-class serverless monitoring support to new workloads over time. Again, check out the links in our episode description for more information. Thanks, Sumetta. That wraps up today's episode. If you have a question, comment, or suggestion for a future episode, comment below or email us. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for future episodes of This Month in Datadog. See you next month.